Hey Hannah, it's not Friday. So in Oxford Dictionary, the word fate means the development of, of events outside a person's control regarded as predetermined by a supernatural power. And throughout history, fate has been mentioned in various cultures and religions. So in Greek mythology, fate is personified and depicted as um, three deities. The Koloth, Kolotho, who is responsible for spinning the life threads. Lachesis, the sister who decides the length of one's life thread. And Anthropos, who possesses the shear to end a person's life, life threat. I'm pretty sure I butchered all the pronunciation. Um, in Orthodox Islam, it is said that Allah has cre- decreed all things from eternity in the Quran. So roughly it means that the, prof- the Prophet himself knows when will things happen in what ways, according to my research. And in Christianity, God's decree it's said to be not it's said to be it's said to not be a predetermined and unalterable all unalterable as there is salvation salvations in all believers except when it comes to death or big destruction apparently. Um this is all fairly interesting and in um, one religions differ from others that is Buddhism it is said that fate is is it is a predetermined inevitable and unalterable event however it is not um, it is not controlled by a supreme being from above uh as I think it believes that uh, the person itself is able to alter this the course of event. I'm sure your mother, your mother would know this more than me. And you know me, Hannah. I'm an atheist, so personally, I do not like the idea that someone from from some places that I do not know, or someone that I have never met before. Oh, I will never meet until, I guess, my death is controlling my um, life course, I guess. But I am spiritual, so the, I guess the good and the bad things that we have done will create a crippling effect. Um, and I... And I put I put it as a metaphor. It feels like fate. Perhaps is like the stars that are far far away from the Earth. Okay, they are light years away from Earth, and the lo- and the light they are emitted take would takes a long time to reach the Earth and to our eyes. It takes time, but eventually. You will get here. So it's the it's just a matter of time. So what I really want to say is that human bio, the subject I refused to make an effort in in high school, has come back inevitably, like fate. I will see you next week, Hannah.